In this crochet basics tutorial, I will show you how to make an unusual crochet 3D pico. Before I made a row of double crochet stitches. To begin our row by making a chain of 3 to bring up the yarn 1, 2, 3 and make double crochet into the second stitch. For this yarn over the hook, we skip the first stitch, insert the hook into the second stitch, pull up a loop, pull through two loops twice. And on the top of this double crochet I will make a pico. For this, make a chain of 3, 1, 2, 3. And now work around 3 chains. Now yarn over the hook, insert the hook around the chain and pull up a loop. Hold all loops on the hook with your finger. We need to do 7 times. First is done. We should crochet 6 more. 2 3 4 5 and 6 and make the last one. Hold all loops on the hook with your finger. Now yarn over the hook and pull through all loops on the hook. Make a chain and constrict a little bit. Now insert the hook into two loops of the double crochet like this. Yarn over the hook, take the working yarn, pull it through at once by making a slip stitch. The first pico is made. It is made on the top of the double crochet. Make some double crochet in a row. Make the first one through the next stitch. The second one. The third one through the next stitch. And let's repeat the pico. Make double crochet through the next stitch. And on the top of this double crochet I will crochet a pico. For this chain 3, 1, 2, 3. Now work around 3 chains, yarn over the hook, insert the hook around the chain, pull up a loop. We need to do 7 times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, six, seven. As you can see, I hold all loops on the hook with my finger. Then yarn over the hook and pull through all loops on the hook, like this. Make a chain and constrict a little bit. Insert the hook into two loops of the double crochet like this. Take the working yarn, pull it through at once by making a slip stitch. The second pico is done. In this part we have learned how to make one of the kinds 3D pico. This is front side and let's take a look at the back side. You can use such pico as a border for your project. Thanks for watching.